guys and welcome back to the vlogs i'm just propping you up on here i feel like i look a little bit disheveled which is a weird way to start the vlog but it's currently monday and it is half five and i thought i'd pick the camera up at the start of the week but i've just basically been filming all day today i've been doing some styling reels which if you don't follow me on instagram you can go over there and follow me because i've been doing a lot of styling reels which i feel like it was really good the fact that you guys sent in some requests and i listened like today i filmed some for like layering outfits and jank so i feel like jank can just be a bit of a weird period with what to wear you can head over there and find some inspo on what to wear right now and how to style your outfits and i'm also focused on stuff that you even have in your wardrobe already that you can recreate but on another subject of off fashion and onto food, you guys know I'm a big foodie. I'm back on Hello Fresh this week. So if you watched my vlog last week, which was the first one of 2022, you'd have seen that I did like a clear out of the kitchen and I just am basically getting on a bit of a kickstart health hype. The typical kind of like January getting back into it kind of vibe at the minute and just eating a lot healthier in the week. So me and Chris have vouched that we're not going to drink in the week we'll just drink on weekends because i can't do dry jan i love my wine and i love my food so i'm eating healthy in the week and then i can treat myself a little bit on the weekend and not feel so guilty obviously i am doing my workouts alongside and working out with my pt as well so i thought i'd show you what i've got from hello fresh you guys know i've been getting hello fresh now for years i love them i just think it's such a great way to eat healthier because they do the low calorie recipes that you can look into they do literally ones for family so you can kind of tailor it to you and your lifestyle and like today i don't have time to go and do the food shop i've got to sit at my desk the rest of the night chris is getting back from work late so it's just easier that this is now delivered to my door i can unpackage it and just cook us a nice meal tonight with all the ingredients it's just honestly so much easier and especially in jan if you're looking at you know trying out some new recipes it can get quite boring at home cooking a lot and if you're also trying to save money, it's a great way for doing it because you just get all the ingredients in this box. So I just think it's a win-win. I will show you what I've got on the menu for this week. I got a little side dish as well. I love trying out new recipes. So I normally go for new ones rather than like always the ones that we like. So we've got teriyaki prawn pokey style bowl which is this one so you get these little recipe cards you guys know by now if you're watching the vlogs how hellofresh works but if you don't if you're new here and if you're new to hellofresh you pick out your recipes it comes in the box it gets delivered to your door you pick the day you want it and also you can cancel your subscription at any time so say if you're going on holiday and obviously you might not be home for like two weeks you can pause it you can cancel it and I have a 50% off code for you guys if you are new to HelloFresh and it'll get you 50% off your first box and then 35% off the rest of the boxes. Which is, if you think about it, such an amazing saving. You're getting 50% off your weekly food shop. So definitely try it out if you are new to HelloFresh and then you get 35% off the other boxes as well. So on the menu this week, we're doing the teriyaki prawn bowls, which I've never done before. And I thought this would actually be good for like a lunch as well when I'm at home and I need to make something quick on the go. So that's that one and the calories it actually says this only takes 35 minutes and the calories in it is only 400 calories which is really good as well. We've got roast lamb and salsa verde. I feel like I'm not saying that right but you can see here on the little menu card what it is. Comes with roast potatoes, carrots and cabbage and this again is a little bit more calories actually so i think i'll probably have this maybe like later on in the week or even on sunday would be quite nice if then this one is the thyme roasted chicken with roasted veggies and sweet chili glaze so super healthy and again this is around 500 calories I did a side dish which is honey drizzled bacon wrapped halloumi with sweet chili mayo i don't like mayo so i think i'm just going to do sweet chili but mm, nice little snack on the side so i'm going to unpackage this so you can see how it works so you basically have your recipe cards so this is number four in the bag so that will be recipe card here the teriyaki bowls i usually just keep it in the bag so that i know what's in the bag goes with the recipe card which is a lot easier but i will leave the link in the description where you guys can sign up i will leave the code on the screen as well and i'm going to unpackage this now and put it all in the fridge I 
feel like my hair is getting wilder as this vlog is going on. It is the end of the day. But on tonight's menu, I'm gonna do the chicken and veggies. So time roasted chicken with roasted veggies and sweet chili glaze. It takes 45 minutes. So Chris just rang me, he's like, I'm on the way back. So I thought I'd start it now. Pretty easy, I'm gonna follow these steps and cook some yummy dinner. shining today and I'm not complaining because yesterday was miserable as sin I didn't actually really pick up the camera yesterday since I was doing dinner the other night because I was out shooting and it was just raining and it was just really miserable yesterday so I managed to get some shots actually shot so you'll see those over on my Instagram but today I'm very excited I got up this morning and I filmed my best and worst purchases of last year my designer luxury one so that will actually probably be live I think before this video goes up so if it is I will link it and also down below so you can catch up on that but I filmed that this morning. Now I'm actually about to head out. I'm running late. One of my New Year's resolutions was to not be late this year. So I'm trying to make sure I can catch up with the time. Because I'm going to go see my best friend Amy. I have not seen her since she's had her newborn. There was just like loads of different reasons um, over the Christmas period that are wires got crossed and we couldn't see each other. So I'm so excited to go and see little baby Hector. I'm actually driving up to Windsor, so it's going to be like a good hour drive there and back. I'm going to go there and have a lovely ladies that lunch, um, lunch today and meet Hector and have a little baby cuddles. I'm so excited and I'll quickly show you my outfit before I leave as well. So this is my outfit. I have got my little Dior hoops in and I've just blow dried my hair and I quite actually just gonna leave it like this all just like blow dried out. This jumper I have been living in. You might have seen it in my last vlog as well. I love it. It's from Studio by Charlotte. It literally looks like the dupe of the Tatem one, if I'm saying that right. Probably butchered it. But I have also found a few online that are very similar, which I will link down below. I just think it's such a gorgeous jumper. Very easy for this kind of like period in jam where you don't know what to wear and it just works. So I've put it with my Zara leather trousers, faux leather trousers, sorry, and my Comme de Garçon trainers just to be comfy because I've got like an hour's drive. And my Chanel bag, I feel like I haven't really been wearing my Chanel bag a lot. It's been sat in my wardrobe, but I thought I'd get it out today. Works with this outfit, simple, comfy, easy, casual look. So before I head out, I've just had these two parcels come from Breville and I honestly love the coffee machine so much obviously I use it every day since I did the masterclass sorry with them I obviously learned how to properly make coffee they taught me how to do espresso martinis as well and I just love this machine so much and now I have the matching kettle and then they've also sent me the toaster as well which is honestly such a lovely gift this was meant to come I think before Christmas but there was a bit of a delay with Royal Mail and me being away so this is just such a nice surprise that it's arrived today so I thought I'd quickly share it with you guys because I highly recommend them and I know I get a lot of questions about my coffee machine and I couldn't recommend this one enough. Okay, I'm popping you up on here because I feel like I have to quickly rush. I really don't want to be late. It's like one of my New Year's resolutions not to be late. Let's take this off as well. Keep that safe. But, like I was saying, I'm loving podcasts at the minute. So, I always listen to Sophie and Chintzia's one, The Girls' Bathroom. I love Stephen's one and Sheppy. I feel like they're really motivational. So if you guys have any good podcasts, let me know. Like I love reading like thriller books. I feel like I should probably do that with like audio books as well. Especially because I'm driving a lot now. Obviously I have a lot more time. God, where's that gone? To listen to things. So I've got a set off. I've put it in the sat nav. And I think it's saying like a good hour's drive. Let's have a look. Yeah, hour and eight minutes. So hopefully I can shave off a bit of time. It's really nice though, it's sunny, but it's a little bit cold, so I'm gonna whack this heating on and get on the road. So we're just at the Ivy, we've had a lovely lunch, and I'm with Ames and Hector. She is mom of the year, <laughs> with little baby Hector. We've had such a lovely lunch, but I'm having to have a coffee now, because I've got to drive back. 
I've got like an hour and a half drive and then I've got to get re-ready for dinner tonight but I've had such a lovely afternoon and meeting this little munchkin. I'm having to balance you up on here. I can't remember really what I vlogged. I just got so caught up in the moment catching up with Amy and meeting little Hector. It was just so nice, just spending the afternoon with them and having cuddles with him. He's like the sweetest little angel boy. Just seeing her being a mom, it's just so nice. Yeah, I've had like a good hour and a half drive back, getting back into London. I've literally got to go back and let Bailey out, feed him dog mom life and then basically get myself together and head out for dinner tonight so I'm thinking I'm gonna wear my Dior heels the full of the trousers that I've got on and maybe just like a nice top um, I don't really have a lot of time to get ready and then just kind of like zhuzh up my hair and makeup so I'll catch up with you guys when I'm back I'm not even joking I've just come up to make the bed and this is literally what I'm dealing with he thinks he's a human. He's put himself tucked in on my side here. Are you a human? Your mummy side the bed. You need to get up, mister. <laughs> the way he's tucked himself in, I don't even know how he's done it. He is such a character, he kills me. Are you gonna get up today, Bailey? Huh? You gonna get up today? Oh. All right, grumpy guts. Come on. We need to get up. Let's get up. I just can't with him. <laughs> <laughs> out the shower just doing my makeup I literally didn't have time yesterday to show you my outfit before I went out but I ended up doing faux leather trousers that I had on my Dior heels and then like I found a nice black puff sleeve top that I had from Volve it's quite old um and I literally went out to Hakkasan I've got to say we went to Hakkasan and I wasn't like blown away by it it was really nice dinner like I was there with my brother and Chris and everything but it was it, I just I feel like it was a lot for the value if that makes sense like I love going to restaurants and if it is a bit more expensive being like you know I would pay that again I'd come back but just my opinion I didn't think it was that great but today I am getting ready because I'm heading into Central I meet my friend Chloe I haven't seen her since Christmas which I'm really excited for and I have a meeting today with the Cordley team love the girls on the quarterly team are so nice and my manager will also be there so it'll be nice to see her in person because obviously we've been doing everything over zoom recently and then i'm meeting back up with chloe and we're going to have like a little friday wine day and get some content shot which will be really nice i feel like it's nice to get back into the routine of things going out having meetings shooting again just getting some new content and just feeling inspired again. So by the way, I forgot to say, I'm using the Beautiful Skin Charlotte Tilbury. This is now launched. I did speak about this on one of my Vlogmas back at the end of last year and it's now ready to buy on the website. So I'll link it down below. I'm using five neutral and you can see it's such a good match to my skin. And I also use the brush that comes with it. This is the Hollywood Complexion. So concealer, which is a bit more angled, and then this, and it just really like pushes it into your skin. You can see the glow it's given me, and it really is a nice match. I've got a bit of a breakout here, and it does cover it, so I'd say it's like medium to full coverage, but the Flawless Foundation, I feel like, has a bit more of a heavier coverage than this. This is, it feels a lot more hydrating on the skin, though. So I've been using this recently. And I'm happy with it. it. You can still see like your actual skin underneath, which is nice. I don't like it to look too cakey, but like it is covering up my blemishes that I have here. So I'm gonna finish up my makeup and then I will show you once I'm ready.
weird time to pick up the vlog after last time I vlogged, but as you saw, I was kind of running around today and I'm with Chloe reunited. Hey. Literally just been shooting all day and then I had a meeting this afternoon. We finally sat down now. We've shot some, to be fair, we've shot some good looks, haven't we? We've got about three, lots of fillers. Yes. We did well considering the light was like fading on us. Yeah, we did well. And now we're just like, we found like a cute little wine bar just off Oxford Street. Bread, wine, what you need on a Friday. And we're just chilling, so getting back into it. But like, I'm back with Chloe. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, dry we're, back, we're back into routine, yeah. <laughs> Okay, so I have officially been the world's worst vlogger today. I feel like I've just been out and about in London. Like I literally met Chloe, we were shooting, and then I went straight to a meeting with the quarterly team and my manager, which was really nice. We had lunch and caught up, and this is the new products that they've just launched, which I feel really honoured because this just launched today on John Lewis, and this is the Premier Crew new range. So. You guys know if you've been stuck around for a while, I love Cordley products. They just work. They're so good. I've got my mom hooked on them. She loves them. They're just such amazing products. They have a few different ranges and this is the latest range, which I feel very honored to be on the inside scoop of. So this will be available to buy very soon across their website and other retailers, but at the minute you can buy it on John Lewis. So we'll link it down below. So I thought it'd be quite nice to just do a bit of on get ready with me because I have been running around the city all day. I've literally just got home and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna take some time for myself, take off my makeup, and I'm gonna try out these new products. So I've got the Rich Cream, which is the anti-aging one. So this is very much around anti-aging, this range that they have. I have the Refill, which is amazing, so it's sustainable, and also the Serum. And then this one, which I was learning about in the meeting, this is actually for eye and lip. So I feel like we always use like under eye creams, you know, we always give attention in that area, but I guess we never give attention in the lip area apart from like lip balms or like, you know, like lip scrubs. So look how amazing this packaging is. I feel like this just looks so luxe, so premium and I just think cordially always smash it so it comes off and then this is my favorite part because you can put this in your fridge so it goes very very cold and it's one of those applicators where you apply it onto your eyes and it's just like very cooling and obviously de-puffs but with this you can also use with your lips it's eye and lip contour which I never knew until they talked me through it so obviously it's gonna be very cooling. This is one of those products that you want to use in the morning, especially if you maybe you've had a few wines and you need a little bit of judge me up, that you know, make your eyes look brighter, deep puffs, it says to apply morning and evening as well. So I thought, you know what, I'm gonna take my makeup off, use these products and see how they go. Of course, to remove my makeup, like always, I'm using my Elemis Cleansing Balm. This is just always my hero go-to. I will never be without this product. It's just like the bread and butter. It's the only thing I take makeup off now. Like I would never use a makeup wipe. And also it's a lot more sustainable than using makeup wipes. So if you don't already, I cannot stress enough how much you need. The Elemis Cleansing Balm in your life is just the best way to take off your makeup. And honestly, this is just the favorite part of my day. I've been running around the city all day. I literally haven't had like five minutes to myself. So this is my five minutes at night, just doing my evening skincare and just getting ready to unwind. Chris is cooking dinner. We're doing HelloFresh again tonight. We're doing the lamb recipe. And we're just gonna chill out, have a glass of red and watch our favorite TV programs and just unwind after the week. <laughs> 